three coats of this bad boy. Good morning and happy June 13th. So I don't know if you could tell right now, but Matt and I are painting my studio room right now. So flashback to yesterday. I don't know if you guys saw yesterday's vlog, but we were taping everything up and then we ran out of tape. Look at it. We still have to tape up all of that, all of that, around the windows. So we got a bunch of tape at Home Depot. Yep. And we're gonna continue doing the base coat all around the walls. Gonna let it dry and then maybe do a second coat today. But that's the plan. I'm so excited. My studio room finally looks coming together. Matt, yesterday he was like, I don't know, this paint looks like mac and cheese. It does. <laughs> I love it though. It's a happy yellow color. It's called sunshine yellow for those of you asking. No, it's sunshine it's yellow, yellow from it's Benjamin yellow. Moore. Sunshine it's yellow. Sunshine yellow. Us. This yellow is too yellow. <laughs> it's sunshine yellow. It'll look good when we have all of the furniture yellow in it. Really means everything. It means danger, warning, look out, slow down, happiness. Happy. Like, what the heck is yellow? Yellow is the most confusing color, just like you are as a human. You're the most Stop. confusing. Stop you're the most it. Stop. Human there, is. <laughs> there are children around here. They don't want to see that violence. Mm. Also, guess who came over today? He's hey, dude. Blue, that's mine. We went to the dollar store. We got a bunch of dog stuff and Canada stuff and this ball. <laughs> Guys, the dollar store is the hookup for everything, yo. <sighs> dollar store haul. <gasps> hey guys, today I'm gonna be doing a haul on what I got at the dollar store. Number one, <laughs> Canada Day. <laughs> <laughs> Number two, we have a glow in the dark frisbee. Blue's never played with a frisbee before. They have played. Number three, Matt insisted on getting this. Ah, it's a pooper scooper. Number three, so we have birds outside of our house. So I, I wanted to get this from the dollar store. It was like a dollar. So we can hang it and the birds can eat the little seeds. Number four, some balls. Balls. I kid you not, I was at the PetSmart the other day and there were almost the exact same balls, like colorful balls. Four of them for seven dollars. You know how much this one was? Honey, it was two dollar. I just say five dollar. Five dollar I can spend on mac and cheese. Five dollars I can spend on five Kit Kat bars. Like that's all I'm saying. Dollar store is the actual hookup. And then lastly, you guys already saw this. That ball over there. Where's your ball? <laughs> that ball was like two dollars. Blue, show it. It's a haul video. Show. So I'm blue. This is the ball that I got. <laughs> I saw it and it reminded me of mine and Joey's collab. Do you guys remember that? It was our dollar store challenge. That was so fun. Wow. Very good hauling, Blue. <laughs> Duke, are you tired? Oh my god. He just fully splew on the ground. He can't fully splew because he has to protect his balls. <laughs> Outside, but they're so hot. It's blue. Wow. <laughs> Dude, come over here. What's that on your nose? He has paint on his blue has paint on her paw. Guys, you're a mess. Oh my god. Dude, are you okay? <laughs> oh, little princess. Are you so tired? You did a very good job helping painting with your toe. Look at this. <laughs> Dude, I know it was you. Look at your paw. We're gonna need a fourth coat. You're like blue. Blue has a little bit of yellow on her mouth too. Acknowledge what I'm saying. We're gonna need a fourth coat. Well, I think that it looks good. It doesn't look splotchy or anything, but Matt's very picky. Like, I think it looks good. Look at this blue. Do you see her? 
I'm so happy. Okay, what time is it? It's 6.53 right now, and we just finished the third coat. We're thinking of sleeping on it, letting it dry for the night, and then if Matt still doesn't like it, I like it, then we can do a fourth coat tomorrow morning. But I personally think it's good. I think that it's perfect. Look at our kids. Like, this is officially our house now. Like, it's yellow. I'm so happy. Matt went to take a shower because he's working in a couple minutes. And, yo, while Matt goes to work, I thought that I should unbox the first, well, I guess the second ever package that has ever came to this house. Look at what came. Windsor sent me a bunch of clothes. And you guys have a meet and greet with Windsor. Follow me on my Instagram if you want to figure out the information. It's at Mall of America. I'm not sure by the time the vlog is up, I'll have a meet and greet. But check out my Instagram because it'll say when my meet and greet is. If you live near Mall of America. But <laughs> thank you for letting me paint my studio. I know you didn't want to. You owe me a lawn tractor. Mm is it worth a lot more than painting? Well, we need both, so. I have to deal with this every single day. He has to deal with this every single day. I'm gonna you're wipe my paint on you because you're gonna take a shower. You just rubbed <laughs> your butt on me. <laughs> I guess this is gonna be my first ever haul in the new house. So exciting. Windsor store. I don't even know what I'm getting. I sent them, I was like, can you guys just send me a bunch of yellow, like cute, because they have so much yellow stuff. A bunch of yellow things. I see some yellow, first of all. If you know me, I, you know that I have my weak moments and I want like designer things, but in debt, bought a house. <laughs> so I found, this is a belt, it kind of looks like a Gucci belt. You know, if you were to squint your eyes from far away, it has that like trendy look to it. You see? It kind of, kind of a little bit. If you look from far away, it looks like a Gucci belt. So I'm so happy that they sent that because I wear black belts literally all the time. Now this one, I thought was so sick. So this is like a double-sided belt. It looks like something that you get at like free people or some bohemian store. I really love that. Oh, I remember this. So I asked you guys what I should wear to my VidCon meet and greet, and you guys said this one. Oh, wait, they sent both. <gasps> A lot of you guys voted red. So I have this red two piece. You see, like this? Oh, honey, you would look so cute. Everyone looks so good in red. And I love two pieces. Oh, you don't even have to think about your outfit. Oh, the best. Next. Okay, so I also thought this was very like, Windsor's very like trendy, but like on a budget. You know what I'm saying? So I thought that this was very like Gucci, yet Adidas esque. So it has this top to match with these bottoms. I thought I was being trendy. This is so comfy, by the way. I thought it was cute. Super like Gucci. I hate myself. Me fulfilling my Gucci wants, but like on a budget, you know what I'm saying? Ooh, I got this yellow off the shoulder crop top. Look at blue. Blue's just like looking at what I'm opening with her little yellow on her lip. Do you realize you have a little bit of yellow on your lip, Blue Blue? Oh! Okay, so <laughs> I've seen so many Instagrammers wear these kind of shades. <laughs> I look so dumb in it, but like, ooh. Like them, but I thought these were super trendy glasses. Windsor always has the trendy stuff first. I, I swear, I can never find all of the trendy stuff on anywhere except for Windsor. Oh, this romper I loved. It has like this little cut in the back. I don't know. I just thought it was like a super like girl next door romper. And then this, this is the same bodysuit as the red one that I showed you. Ta -da! And then, oh, I don't like wearing jeans every day. I feel like I literally wear jeans every day. So it's nice to mix it up. I have like this yellow and white pants. These vertical stripes, I swear to you, do magic in pictures. They just make me look way longer and thinner. That's just what vertical lines do. They make you look longer and thinner. I literally slipped just there. So I was like, uh, need. Add the guards. And then, ooh, this yellow two-piece. Have you ever seen anything more Adeline? And I really loved this. Like bohemian pattern with, and it's yellow. Like Vanessa Hudgens meets Ariana Grande. That's all I'm saying. That's my style, I feel like. Oh, and then this. Okay, so I saw something on Free People and they wore a flowy skirt like this with like a white top and it looked so cute, even though it's so simple. <laughs> of course, me being Ariana. No, wait, I think Vanessa. Vanessa wore something like this. And this was the time that I was shopping for Windsor. These cargo pants, love. And then, surprisingly, I don't have these. Just basic white shorts. And I love Windsor shorts. And then, ah, I forgot I ordered this. The Cutest. You would literally see this on Pinterest. Like some travel vlogger in Bora Bora. You know what I'm saying? With her boyfriend, kissy face. No, with her boyfriend, with the arm like this looking back. Like definitely wearing this. Like this is, I thought this was so cute with the little the lace and the tie up. I just wanted to be a travel vlogger, okay? And oh, I have 
these pants in this pattern, but I found they have a romper version. I fell in love. Again, with the vertical stripes making me look tall and thin. I don't know if you guys know, but I went to fashion class when I was a lot younger. Maybe I think it was like grade 10, I think. And we would learn about all of the like patterns and shapes and lines. And you know how vertical lines make you look a lot thinner and then horizontal lines make you look wider. You know, stuff like that we would all learn in fashion class and I was just like so thankful. I feel like honestly, out of all of the classes that I've been to in high school, I've learned the, the most in fashion class. I also was the most passionate in fashion class. I was actually listening. <laughs> and then how could I not? If I was just put into a clothing item, like First of all, it's a romper, so it's easy. You don't have to think about your outfit, you just plop it on. Second of all, the color. This yellow romper, it literally is blending into the background. So it's this yellow romper and then a cut in the back. It's like appropriate in the front, cut out in the back, best of both worlds. It's like pretty thick quality. And then this, I thought was really cute. This reminded me, okay, I'm not gonna lie, of Tiffany. Miss Tiffany Ma. It's this polka dot. It literally looks like Liv and Jess. As you can tell, I really like rompers because I don't like thinking about my outfits. Like even, I can screw up anything. I can put jean shorts and an ugly top and somehow, somehow make it look ugly. So having a romper, not having to think about my outfit is just like the best idea ever. To me at least. I remember this. This too piece it's like a high low a high low skirt it has this matching top again very bohemian and then oh my god this bikini set i'm deceased because i personally my tatatas are pretty you know out there whereas my uha down here isn't that popping so i got this bikini set and it's a high-waisted bikini so i feel like you know it'll make you look nice and like curvy like accentuate the booty area you know stuff that we all know and love you know what i'm saying so i'm excited to try this bikini on and then the last thing i have two pairs of shoes I love shoes. Recently, I've been so obsessed with shoes. Ugh, yes. So I really needed a pair of just normal wedges because I have a bunch of heels, but whenever I go like, outside in the grass and I try to walk, it's so embarrassing because my heel just like sinks into the grass. So having like a nice, good pair of nude wedges that goes with every outfit, you know? Like romper, wedges, done. And then the last thing in the box. Ah! I'm so happy they had these. Oh my God. So you guys know me. I am five foot. Okay, I say I'm five foot two, but I'm really five foot one. Okay, I'm really short. So <laughs> I got these shoes. Yo, they reminded me so much of their. What's the new one? The I think Aldo or Spring has shoes very similar to these. Hold on, but they're like a hundred dollars. I'm pretty sure they were like like ridiculous. I was like, they're so beautiful and like shoes are amazing, but a hundred. Oh my god. Guess how much these are? You just guess. Twenty eight dollars. <laughs> I just love Windsor. So we have these little shoes over here. I'm gonna make sure that they fit. I'm putting it on with like my painted feet. Yes! I'm so tall in these. I literally feel like Ariana. How tall are these? They're like, these must be like five inch heels. Oh my God, I love. And they would go with every outfit that I just showed you guys. I mean, obviously besides my <laughs> yellow legs. But that's everything I got from Windsor store. Thank you so much for Windsor store for giving me all these amazing outfits. I wanna definitely wear at least one of these outfits to my meet and greet on, I think it's on Saturday the 16th. So if this vlog goes up before the 16th, make sure to check out my Instagram. It's at Mall of America, Windsor store, June 16th, I think from 12 to 2 p.m. You have to check my Instagram to make sure that I'm saying everything right, but I don't know what to wear. I have so many like cute outfits. By the way, that random guy that was helping us paint, what is his name? His name's Tyler. Mm -hmm. Good guy. He's a good guy. Um, helped us paint. He helped us paint. Four hours for beer. Beer and pizza. <laughs> Fun fact in Canada, I don't know if it's the same way in America, but beer is practically currency down here. It's currency. Pretty much. It's a form of currency. <laughs> well, I'm going to end the vlog here. I hope that you guys enjoyed today's vlog. I really enjoyed it. I thought this was one of my most, like, one of my favorite vlogs I've ever filmed. Love. Why are you giving me that look? Because you get to end your vlog and go to bed. Yeah. I have to vlog and edit. Okay, and he's just salty because he doesn't have my amazing editor, Rosie. Okay, okay. I started editing all of my videos, my main channel and my vlog, okay? For years. You are just starting this Girl, year. I can't afford Rosie. Why you you got to start from the bottom. If I hired Rosie full time, I'd be in a deficit. And started from the hard. bottom, now we here. She is worth it. I'm working my way to afford her. Mm -hmm. We're fighting over money. Rosie, my editor, right now. <laughs> I've edited my own videos for I think like five years, five or six years. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. my own videos for five or six years. You're, You're struggling on your first year. I'm struggling to stay awake. <laughs> well, I hope that you guys enjoyed today's vlog. Today's tip of the day goes to Adel Angels underscore more and underscore. Ta da! She sent over happy is the new rich because. Hey. What? I can't even afford headphones. I can hear you. I can't hear my video. <laughs> okay, let me just end my vlog. What was the tip of the day? 
happy is the new rich because you rich. can have as many helicopters you can have as many houses and mansions you can have as many cars and things but if you don't have someone to share it with then what's the point okay well i hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog i was gonna say something but i forgot say you appreciate me for painting your damn room i appreciate matt for painting my damn room for me because because that was that was a lot of work a lot of work and effort and effort love what you're crazy you're crazy well, i hope you guys have a beautiful magical wonderful day i'll see you guys in my next daily vlog tomorrow stay tuned for an empty house oh, tour on my main oh, channel baby. i love you guys have a beautiful magical wonderful day same day same time yes. i love you guys bye yes. what Watch no bye <laughs> Ha 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 ha